Good day, Detroit. Welcome to the Big Brown Couch with Lee Thomas, Dina Santafanti. Good and morning. Me, Jason Carr. Uh, obviously, the story of the day is leading our news, and we hear that more shots have been fired. Let's go right to the news with Anquinette. Huge TV audience watching the Lions on Fox 2 yesterday. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And it was a good one to watch. Well, at the end, anyway. Yeah. <laughs> the Lions. As far as high drama. Yeah, opened the 2012 season with a true nail biter. They beat the Rams 27. Um, everybody just went to him immediately, left Smith wide open. It was like uh, the best decoy play you could have ran. Easy, dumped it right to him, walked right in. Love yeah, to see that good. kind of stuff. It was good. And then you finish watching that game and you turn on the Tigers and watch <laughs> them <laughs> go like two for 56 with runners <laughs> in scoring position. Yeah, what's happening to the Tigers? They're so frustrating. Even if they make the postseason, they've been a frustrating team to watch all summer so long. So inconsistent. It's like, you know, you want to... Yeah. Last year, there were all those dramatics, and, yeah. and Justin Verlander was... was uh, <laughs> have you guys noticed the lion statues popping up around town? Yes, we have. They're yeah. about, what, 58 inches, about my height? Anyway, we've got a contest cooking. So you take your picture... You know, they've been the Tigers before. Mm -hmm. I'd like to put my artistic skills to see yeah, what I you, could, yeah. if I could come up with something that somebody would want at auction. Mm -hmm. Right. You know. Or else you just take it home. <laughs> right. Put it in your wagon. <laughs> Pull it home. Yeah. Yeah. They traveled to 50 Michigan cities in just seven days to highlight the wonderful things the state has to offer. Here is the Pure Michigan Statewide Sing-Along. Sing -along.